Hey guys, how's it going? Selfie Lockpicker here, and the video I have for you today is going over how we can get this Schleg cylinder out of this doorknob. As you can tell, inside this doorknob it looks pretty stuck and it has nowhere to go. In my video number 219, I got many requests on how to do this, so today we're going to show you how we can get this out in just a few seconds. More information is coming up on this, please stay tuned. Alright, so in order to get started, we need to first verify that we have our doorknob off of our door itself. If you need any refresher on how to do that, please check out my video number 219, which I'll link up on the top here, so you can see how to take one of these knobs off in just a few seconds. All you need is the key to your lock and just something to poke a very small detent on the side of the lock. So let's get started with how we can get the lock cylinder out of this lock right now. Alright, so in order to get started, we're going to need our doorknob. And then we're going to need the tool that came with our Schleg lock. If you do not have this tool, you can find anything that is small enough that will fit. So what we're going to need to do is try to get this lock cylinder out of this lock. But the first thing that you're going to notice is how are we going to get it out because the hole is too small. Just so you can see how the lock cylinders typically come out, on many locks it's going to come apart in two pieces. All you need to do is insert any tool inside and then you're going to be able to pull off the back piece and then a much larger open area with a cutout on the top here is going to allow you to drop your lock cylinder out. However, on this Schleg lock, it is only going to be in one piece and we're not going to be able to do that. So what Schleg has done is they've developed a new type of lock cylinder called their Schleg F series, which has a compressible Bible. On a typical lock cylinder, which you can see here, this one does not have a compressible Bible. The Bible is this top portion here that houses the springs and the driver pins. On the Schleg F series, you can push this in and it will get smaller and be able to be compressed. So that is precisely what we're going to do in order to get this lock cylinder out today. What we're going to do is take any tool that we can fit inside and we're going to sneak it around the top and then we're going to push down on the top of the Bible and then we're going to be able to scoot our cylinder right out. Just so you can get a much closer look. When you take a look at the Bible here, you can see that it is going to be able to be compressed down. With that compression, that's going to make the size of the lock smaller. That is going to make it fit through the smaller hole, and that is precisely how we're going to get it out of our lock today. So this has been a really quick demonstration on how you can get the lock cylinder out of a Schleg F series out of the doorknob. This was a very popular question in my video number 219, and I'm very happy to provide everyone with a little bit more clarity. If you guys have any questions or suggestions, please drop them in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more like it, please subscribe. As always, thank you so much for checking out this video, and I hope you all have a great day. And thank you so much for checking this out.